Good work, Billy. Let's get that controller one day. Beep, beep. Hi, Thomas. Hi. Hey, Fatty and the Hattie. Hey. I mean, human Snorlax. Better. Who's this new guy? Said Thomas. This engine's name is Billy. Billy. Well, what? Why do you need a shunter? I thought in the Reverend W. Audrey books and the TV series that we already took care of this with Percy. Well, now that Percy's being to take trains, not that he owns any, any, any branch lines or anything, but because of, as of me owning a Pokeball factory, a, and, and, and several other kinds of factories, I'm beginning to need, need trains to shunt in the, in the industrial area part of the railway. Also, the narrow gauge and also, I think the narrow gauge engines were getting a lot of ballast recently, and, and yeah, we cracked and we very much need the ballast. All right, Billy. See what you can do. You're shunting trucks. Nope. Uh, time to go. Oh, what's that? Oh, what's that? Matt, someone's pressing the microphone, and making random noises. But it was too late. Thomas left. Ah, bugger. Alright, Billy. Go see what you can do. Do in the industrial area. Okay, fatty. Why does everyone call me fat? Said the fat controller. What is every. And, and why, um, when everyone does that, oh god, it's always humorous. Well, uh, ow. That's a really big bullet. Didn't really kill me, but. Didn't knock me down. Besides, it is made of plastic anyway. Hey, come back here, Billy. You need to be under supervision. <laughs> Sit, laugh, Billy. Hillbillies. How do they work? Ba bum, ba bum, ba bum. Billy was going to show up off the train. Finish shunting some trains. Shunting. His driver thought they should go a look around. Yeah, hey, Billy, let's just go look around or something. Because I'm bored. Alright. Soon. When the points were switched, their top of hat came flying out of nowhere. Woo hee! Billy, I read the script and turns out you did everything well, and I think you'll make us a perfect shunt sh shunter. You've been accepted into the ray sort of a railway or north western railway or whatever the whatever. You've been accepted. Yay! Billy said. And rocket it off. You see, America, this is why we're going for a for for a YTP free America. This has been an, an ironic statement. Billy was chugging down when when Gordon came out. 
Hey, so you're the new guy I heard, judging by, by me writing. <laughs> Looking at the script. Who are you? said Billy. I'm Gordon. Who are you? Oh, I'm Billy, the new shunter in. Railway shunter. Hmm. You look kind of good. You remind me a bit of Percy, but you look much stronger. What do you mean, strong? I know this engine named Wilbur. He looked almost exactly like you. He was stronger than Percy. You know, saddle tank engine. They're very unpredictable. I'd better be going now, said Billy. Yeah, more important than the turntable. Even though the turntable just turned for you. You? Sort of like Gary O. Like a, I'm like a jerk. Like a... Steal the turntable like a jerk. Oh, come on, said Billy. So, Billy went off. <whistles> Billy le left the tunnel. Billy had to stop. Hey, who are you? said Billy, looking down at an air gauge engine. Oh, hi, my name is Renas. One of the engines for the narrow gauge railway. Huh, I kinda heard you. Well, I've heard about you. Aren't you that engine that covered for Scar Lowly when he was being repaired? Yeah, how did you know? I'm not stupid. Well, when you're with Sir Handel, it kinda feels like you are with stupid, but it doesn't really matter a lit in some shape, way, or form. Yeah. Also, also be careful. It was too late. The layout was unfinished, and Billy went off the track. Oh no! I'm missing those. Got me. Oh no! And looking right upside down was the camera. And so, oh, Billy went back to the sheds. Boom, 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 boo, boo, bing. Over the next few weeks, Billy began and grumbling to himself. Percy came up. No. Hey, what are you grumbling about? What? What do you mean grumbling? Hit. You're saying about you're you're saying mean stuff. Well, yeah, it must be my uh, <laughs> condition. I so. Condition? So Percy, yeah. Billy didn't say anything. Charged at Percy. Ow, said Percy. And Billy tell And then the narrator said, Don't don't tell a poor box. Uh oh. Ow. Meanwhile, James the semi splint Yeah. I crashed into Billy. Crashed into Billy's train. When Percy was back in the rails, Percy took the somewhat unhurt cars and away. James was upset. The next day, oh yeah, I forgot. Boom, boom, boo, boo, bing. 
James was, was getting getting his coach when Gordon some came out of nowhere to get the express. Are you being the th James talked to Gordon, obviously. Have you ever er, noticed Billy? Yeah. He was kind of a weird engine. And suddenly, yeah. It's, I guess it's his condition. What do you mean condition? Well, he's been doing weird things like park daint, daint, getting loads in the middle, middle of the track for, for an unfortunate engine. I heard that said Billy. Well, um, and the car goes that, that somehow, that somehow randomly, or he randomly parks. Yeah. They're beginning to get more and more dangerous, you know. I mean, my dry, I mean, I heard, heard a rumor that Toby crashed into one of Billy's trains. And his driver got lead poisoning. Eh, well. Yeah, but. That was only a rumor. Yeah, said James. And soon, <laughs> this became to be continued. Bum, bum, bum.